The voting process in Vietnam. On the 23rd of May, elections will be held nationwide in Vietnam. On this occasion, 500 deputies for the National Assembly and 3,715 representatives of the People's Councils are going to be elected. Elections will take place in all 63 provinces in a total of 184 constituencies. Every Vietnamese citizen that reaches the age of 18 has the right to vote. Elections are held on a Sunday and the date must be announced at least 115 days in advance. According to the Vietnamese constitution, the elections of the representatives of the National Assembly and of the People's Councils are held in accordance with the principles of universal, equal, direct and secret suffrage. What is the procedure for the actual voting in Vietnam? On the day of the election, citizens who are eligible to vote can go to the responsible polling station. By showing their voter card, they will receive in total four ballots. One for the deputy of the National Assembly and one for each representative of the People's Council at provincial level, district level and commune level. The voters will cast their ballots at a polling station chosen by the ward's People's Council. Important to know, the candidates who are not elected are crossed out on the ballot. Before electing, the voters can again check the voters' lists as well as the names and short biographies of each candidate. Weeks before the election, citizens can already have a look at all the voters and candidate lists in each city district and inform themselves about the candidates. On the 23rd of May, people can go vote from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. and in some localities from 5 a.m. to 9 p.m. After the election, the votes will be tabulated. However, due to logistical reasons, some constituencies started voting early since the 4th of May. The elected members of the National Assembly as well as of the People's Councils will be announced between the 2nd and the 16th of June. According to the Constitution, the first session of the 15th National Assembly shall be convened 60 days after the election of the new members for the National Assembly 2021 to 2026. The session is usually opened by the new chair of the National Assembly. For more information on our projects and activities, make sure to follow us on Facebook at hsf.vietnam.